Well, it comes with the family, doesn't it? When your name is Chang, you're in the culinary business and your teeth are all good. <laughs> what are you doing here today, fellas? Uh, we're helping make little kids make crepes and granola. Right. And uh, when that, the idea is to get to get them what? To get them interested? To get them interested and to like involved, get them involved into healthy cooking. Right. So, to, and it's to stop childhood obesity. Right. Um, how many Super Chefs events now has this been for you? Uh, I think it's been about four or five. Yeah. And what do you think about this idea about uh, tying in, like your dad is Dr. Greg Chang, he knows dentistry, nutrition. What do you think the secrets are about that combination of good food, good teeth, good health? Well, I think it all ties in together into the, into the health health part of the uh, healthy part of life and uh, if you if you do one then usually the others will come with it and they all tie together pretty well yeah I would say so now Ryan watch the oh, oh we have our first emergency <laughs> is that an overflowing pot there goes Austin Ryan just before we let you go <laughs> <laughs> it's a disaster, but it's fun. So, again, we were talking about the tie-in between health, intelligence, brain power, and nutrition. What are your thoughts on that? I think it's it's just great because it'll help the kids so that they can, they'll be able to live longer and live a healthier life. Do you see a direct correlation between what you eat is what you are? Um, in most cases, yes. It's been that way with you? Yeah. Okay, so today you're going to bring these little ones in. How small will they be? Um, I think they'll be anywhere from maybe 5 to 12. Okay. And uh, even if they're nervous, you're going to give them confidence. Yeah. Is the hope uh, that by doing this exercise with a real super chef who's a young man, that what, what do you want them to do? You want them to become super chefs? You want them to look into cooking? What do you want to happen? What's the outcome? I just, I think it's as long as they get involved and they get, they start to, they start to start cooking healthier, then they'll want to, then they'll eat the healthier things. And then it'll result into just, them living longer, being healthier. So it's like uh, Jean-Luc Baron said, it's about education. Yes. Once you know, then the world becomes something easier to manage. Yeah. Thank you, Ryan.